I got to this point where I just felt like I had never really established the drawing and painting foundation that I'd always wanted to. Juliet was just starting her program up in Seattle, and, and so I came up here to Seattle, was the first out-of-state student to, to arrive. After finishing uh, that program, I uh, rented a studio space and started teaching part-time classes, and those part-time classes developed a momentum of their own. That eventually became Georgetown Atelier, kind of organically grew from the ground until we uh, kind of full circle became part of Gage again. Our program focuses on classical drawing and painting, uh, but when I, when I say classical drawing and painting, I consider imaginative realism as part of the classics. Uh, if you consider uh, the majority of classical works, uh, you know, whether that be Rembrandt, David, Titian, Rubens, etc., Michelangelo, the Sistine Chapel, there are elements that are beyond just working from direct observation. So we focus on working observationally so that we can understand how to visually interpret the world and use those as building blocks to then springboard to territories that are beyond direct observation. Everything about the program is just about Im improvement. It, there's nothing about am I good, am I bad? It's how do I problem solve to improve? And that's the entire emphasis in the, in the working relationship uh, between myself and the students as well as the students amongst themselves.